Boas pessoal, o meu nome é Adsep, estou aqui para vos trazer mais um episódio de Call of Juarez Bound in Blood. O segundo episódio, o segundo episódio, uh, o segundo jogo da, desta saga de Call of Juarez. Uh, este é o quinto episódio, se não estou em erro. É isso. His bark is worse than his bite. You just relax now, darling. We'll be out of your hair in no time. Só precisava do teu dinheiro. I won't hurt you. Só queremos passar. Matamos o xerife. Xerife. Shh. Look. There's stagecoach. Oh. It's better than nothing. Can you get it over here? Look. We should just turn ourselves in. He drew on you first. It was self-defense. You think they gonna believe us? We turn ourselves in, and they gonna stretch our necks. Keep an eye out. When I get back, you jump on. Okay. Cobra Tomás, eu não te vou cobrir, meu. Foi que vai a tua vida, que eu não sou gay. Principalmente ainda somos irmãos, alô. Ei, meu! Oh, eu só gosto de ter uma arma, meu. Gosto de fazer zoom. Gosto de fazer zoom. Ah, pá, precisava era de uma. de uma arma em condições. A long alcance. A long alcance. Quer. 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 Oi. Oi, que eu estou a morrer. Oi, que eu estou a morrer. Já está. O que é? Ah, foi. Vambora. Aqueles cavalos parecem... Parecem... Cavalos, não é? Oi, 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 oi. Watch out, out, out. Watch out, out, out. How about this time we don't rush in like a bunch of chickens with their heads cut off? Oh, knock them on their asses! Vamos matar manos. Há mais? Não há mais. Será que há mais? Não. Oh, pai, precisava... Eu precisava da arma do Tomás. Porque a arma do Tomás é melhor que a minha. Não, eu, eu, eu quero lá saber da wagon. Eu queria ver se, se havia aqui alguém com... Uh, com armas, tipo... Ah, está aqui. Afinal tenho. <risos> ah. Empurrar, vamos lá empurrar isto. Tem que ir para onde? Fogo, é sério. Vambora, vambora. Parece que estava ali um gajo. Afinal não. Tem 12 munições, mais 34. Caraças, aí meu, lá se vai a roupa da senhora, meu. Ela, bem, ela também já não estava a secar, porque quer se dizer. Uh, explosions, estão a ver aqui? Uh. Consegue, consegue ter melhor explosions do GTA V. Ai caraças, tanto boi. Vamos a onde? Ah, eles assustam se vão-se embora, tá bem. Pensava... Ih, eles até deitam um moinho abaixo. Oh, está assim em movimento. É complicado. Holy shit! 
turn around or they'll cut us off. Oh, mine so. See them. Oh, too late. They got us. Not yet. Right. What are you doing? Are you That's my look. Just put this on our tail. Go! Go! Yeah! See, come on board. Oh, one day, you're gonna get us killed! <laughs> hmm. He's nervous. I shoot, I shoot the ass. Bomba. Bomba, 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 bomba. Hola mano 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 ay 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 Move it before they get us. Get inside. Happy. Happy to take us in there. They're waiting for us. They're here. Oh, what? Don't see anything. They're behind here. Oh, look! I'm going to have to kill the cowboy. For a a mere match, Smil. Ah, he, isto assim sim, mas estão a ver, a mira mexe-se meu, assim, quer se dizer, uma pessoa não, é mais realista, isto é mais realista, então não me matas, só se for no inferno, ah, posso disparar uh, por entre as tábuas, está bem, por mim está bem, Olha, 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 olha este que é maluquinho. Oi, 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 Ah, filha da mãe. Ah, filha da mãe já foi. Também já foi. Ok, não consegui matar aqueles. Estou a ficar sem munições. Será que gaivaram? Não sei se gaivaram. Oh, que parece não. Dynamite! William, hurry up! Look out! Shut up, bitch! E caraças! Ih, meu! Não consigo ver nada, não consigo ver para trás. Teve aqui uma tábua e um banco. O que esses assholes fazem? Vocês pecaheads que kissem a minha ass! O que é que isso aconteceu? You dumbasses! You blocked your own path! Live by the dynamite, die by the dynamite. Let's take the horses, but leave that damn coffin. They won't catch us. Engraçado. E acabou mais um capítulo. Lord in heaven, what have you done? Well, it's not like we had a choice. You just killed a U.S. federal marshal. Don't you know they're gonna hunt you down to the ends of the earth? Then I say we go to Mexico. Sunshine and senoritas. Nothing wrong with that. Besides, I've heard tales of an Aztec treasure buried in the hills just outside of Juarez. Well, what about our plan? Rebuilding our family farm. Reclaiming our land. That's why I want the treasure, brother. Without gold, that plan is just a fantasy. We're never gonna settle down, are we? You're like mad dogs, tearing at each other's throats. Tem calma, rapaz. By the way, brother, if you ever steal another woman away from me, I swear to God I will take your life. You understand me. Isto agora ficou tenso. 
muito tenso. Dear Lord, how do I free my brothers from Satan's embrace? What words do I use to convince them that the Lord loves and forgives them? Now we're on the run to Mexico. Ray is dragging us there to find a mythical treasure, for he believes we can use it to rebuild our family farm. I must continue to preach the truth and turn my brothers towards the light. Because when all is said and done, we are family. Não é nada triste, vamos lá buscar o tesouro. O tesouro de Juarez. É por isso que este jogo chama-se Call of Juarez, né? O chamamento de Juarez. Que é o tesouro de dinhe dinheiro. Ok, quero lá saber dos segredos, meu. Vamos lá carregando. Running River Set. War! Running River. Gathers a tribal council, but won't listen to our council. I don't need advice from old women who have forgotten how to fight. You say the treasure is cursed. I say it belonged to the ancient ones, our ancestors. And it is the source of power. It is the people of this land who were given the key to the secret place. So Running River will wage a war on the white man. He will use the sacred medallion to buy many rifles. Puma's paw asks, who will sell us these rifles? The whites? Perhaps we can ask them to shoot themselves as well. Puma's paw has no teeth anymore and meows like a kitten. In the south, where the treasure is hidden, Live a people who hate the white coyotes as much as we do. They will sell us the weapons. It is beyond the mountains and across the great river. Who will venture on this journey? My son, Shajam, seen father. He speaks the language of the whites as did his mother. My son, it is time for you to prove that you are one of us. By causing a war, which will bring annihilation upon our people? Seeing farther deserves his name. And maybe he deserves to be called coward. Imbayabisha. No one, not even the great Apache chief running river will call me a coward. Then prove your worth. Prove you're an Apache. Beyond. All right, father. I will journey south and find someone to sell us these rifles. You will have your war. Running River does not respect the creator or those who remember his childhood. He wants to take the medallion from its place of safety and bring the life giver's wrath down on his people. It won't be Running River who makes the sacrifice. But his tribe and his son, Puma Paw, has spoken. Running River has spoken. Prepare for war. Oh my God! This will be tears and bombs and so much trombas. Hey, agora sim também. Tá tudo preto para já e a tudo isso. She looks like an angel. Ela parecia um anjo. Vambora. Mexico. What a godforsaken land. Ray heard tales of a great Aztec treasure hidden in the foothills near the border town of Juarez. It was said to be cursed and that all who seek it will find only madness. The locals call this greedy fever the call of Juarez. Ray laughed off the curse and convinced Thomas that we could use this treasure to rebuild our life and our home back in Georgia. We were talking about this very subject in a little cantina near San Lorenzo when my brothers first laid eyes on her. Oh my Dios. She looked like an angel. Looks can be deceiving. Verdade. Verdade, sim, senhor. 
México, proximidades de San Lorenzo, 1866. The promise of that treasure is attracted to shitload of low lives looking for easy money. Are you talking about us, little brother? No. Jesus. That treasure is nothing but a fairy tale. There's only one decent way for God-fearing people to make their fortune with hard work and sacrifice. Claro, claro. Or we can find some rich son of a bitch and put a gun to his head. Oh, my Dios. Drunk. <laughs> I'm getting there. Tomorrow we'll buy some equipment and start our search. We got a lot of ground to cover. Right now, though, I just need a little more tequila and a woman of questionable moral character. Oh, my Dios. Tá de uma gaja. Oh meu Deus, é a Penélope Cruz! A Penélope Cruz Estrábica, pronto, vá. Um bocado estrábica a moça, não é? Olha, este já se apaixonou. Hum, jeitosa a moça! Who the hell is that? I don't know. Watch your hurry, little lady. Baboso. Mr. Devlin, I'd like to see you. What if I don't want to see him? He wants to see you today, senorita, in his bed, wearing nothing but a smile. Pendejo! Hey, canais. Mesmo porco, guys. But he never buys a mare unless it's already broke in. So maybe I should take you for a ride and knock some of the fight out of you. You little whore! Eish, headshot, man. Foz moça. Tá aqui o Salvador. Olha o outro gajo estrábico. Olha o contra o governo. Bem, acho que vou jogar com o Tomás. Tomás. Tomás, acho que é bom. E, uh, e pronto. Uh, vamos ficar. Uh, oi! Vamos ficar por aqui. Sim. Uh, por isso, pessoal, se gostaram deste vídeo, meu então gosto. Subscrevam-se, adorando os senhores favoritos. E partilhem se não gostaram, meu então diz like e não subscrevam. Vemos-nos num próximo episódio de Call of Juarez Bound in Blood. Não se esqueçam de comentar. Beijinhos, abraços e. Pau!